Sunday Night Football, man. I'm excited, bro. I am excited, guys. What is up, Corey, Daniel, Chris, anyone on the stream, dude? Yeah, I mean, dude, we already streamed today, but you know what? To be fair, it is Sunday Night Football. And also, hey, man, even if we get like three, four games in, it's still a W. Um, we got to get daily goals done as well for Comp Pass and for the daily goals as is. They are going to, remember, guys, season six comes out in nine days, guys. So nine days is season six. I already went over um, the AKA stuff um, pretty much from here. It really depends on the abilities. So, you know, we, you know we're probably not going to talk about them for that long. But, I mean, really the idea is, hey, look, it's not just AKA, but they're dropping three of these other players. So I kind of like that for more variation in the game for, like, different players, different ability stacks, or whatever. So we will definitely see how that goes tomorrow and their abilities and their X factors. So look forward to that coming up tomorrow. Remember, tomorrow is also the solar eclipse. Obviously, around the United States, everyone getting ready for that as well. It's pretty much a one in 200 plus years thing. So pretty much once in our lifetime. So obviously, you don't want to miss that and really enjoy uh, that while it happens tomorrow afternoon. So I will likely start streaming and then I got to go and then I'll restream later. It'll probably be a two part stream as well. Um, and you know, just all that stuff. So like I said, guys, only nine days until season six. Uh, it's going to be pretty exciting, obviously, to be able to get, uh, pretty much what will be the last season, um, of the game. Um, if they drop somehow a season seven, that's, I mean, it's pointless. Uh, so, you know, they really should do one big season, season six for April, May, and then in the June. And then after that should be over, but. Um, if they do April and May and then June, I don't know. so yeah, it should be it. Season six, dude. I, I cannot believe it. Uh, it really did go fast this year, honestly. I mean, it's not over yet, but it's just, man, it just feels weird. Um, obviously, again, nine days is still a long time, so get what you can done, especially in the comp pass. Because, like I already told you guys, just from doing, come on, dude, please load. That is very glitchy. Do that bro i'm sure some of you guys fucking know that zavin collins i i mean i don't really know for come on dude can you fucking load holy shit i was gonna say are we fucking frozen dude damn it all right so here we go zavin collins and 49 comp points so we may get him obviously tonight may not uh there's a good chance we get him actually but depends on the much champ objective so, rush for, I mean, score 10 touchdowns is fucking bullshit, but we'll get that done, whatever. Okay, cool. Yeah, they didn't really add any more milestones. Like, when they added those milestones in, they added, maybe it was by accident. Maybe they added double by accident, and they're, they're just like, eh, it was an accident. We dropped double the milestones. Now we're done with milestones. I mean, I, 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 mean, I really don't know. EA is EA. Do your best to get this done. Um, that's what matters the most. Uh, you have 18 days for that. The real deals, dude, really all that matters is the XP. Because Carl Weathers, he's good. But, I mean, Micah Parsons is good. You know, so is Trayvon Walker. I mean, and then 95 BND, that's just free training. So I'm not going to go out of my way to get that done. Um, you know, like I said, under objectives, get 15 sacks. I mean, once I get three more sacks, that's 2000 XP, 2000 XP, boom, I get the XP. So we're going to get 30,000 XP. Is that enough to give me the legendary strat item or no, not the strat item. It's going to be enough for what? It's going to be enough for a level 47. And then obviously we have to get more daily goals to get level 48 and level 49. So. All right, man, that's it. So yeah, that is that. Um, in terms of selling my whole team, bro, we did sell a lot of our players. A lot of you guys already know this, but under auctions posted, like I said, I mean, Aaron Donald's, it's guaranteed profit no matter what. It's just a matter of how much profit we get. Selling St. Brown and Tillman was pretty much huge. 
I mean, every, you know, I mean, you know, you guys already heard this. So, you know, I'm not going to really waste my time with this. I mean, you guys already know this by now. If you see my YouTube video, um, uh oh, it's like my Wi Fi is kind of going. Yeah, guys, I'm not sure if you're there or not, but yeah, our internet right now is cutting in and out. So, right now we're four out of five bars. I mean, I think the stream's still working right now, but what's up, John Jay? How you doing, dude? So, we will definitely see how the gameplay goes. If we have one DC loss, we'll probably just call it, but. I mean, obviously, internet is. I'm not, I mean, I'm not even going to get started about the internet. That's fucking crazy. I mean, you know, worst case scenario, we'll play a little soul battle on my own time. But I, I mean, I kind of want to play online today, dude. So. Oh, what's up, Jimmy? I'm doing pretty good. What about you, man? I really hope that we don't get a DC here. I mean, I like, I doubt we do. I mean, the, the internet has to, like, cut out. I still can't believe that we lost a playoff game because of that. And it was fourth quarter, two minutes left. By the way, I might sell Carmichael. I might sell Carmichael. I mean, I was reading up on just... I mean, he's so good, but he's so tall, which hurts his... It, it kind of hurts his gameplay because of his knockout chance. He's so tall that they can knock him out better. So, I mean, for the zone KOs. So, like I said, I mean, you know, brand new season coming up, brand new Compass eventually. Um, that's kind of really where our attention's at. Compass is not for two and a half weeks, though. It's more about the new season, not this Wednesday, next Wednesday. It's going to come sooner than you think. Um, and then also, obviously, this week is Ring of Honor. NFL draft promo should come in season six. Yeah, I'm already seeing some lag issues, some input lag in there. I mean, right now it's good, but obviously it can happen any moment. This guy doesn't really have any X factors, so if we lose, we lose. It's kind of sad. We shouldn't be able to win the season. We're not here to punt the ball, dude. Come on. Good user by him, damn. That Derrick Henry card, bro. I don't, I don't even know why that was a season five master, dude. That, that was a pain in the ass. 
no idea why he was the master. Got to stop Henry here, dude. Nope, couldn't stop him. Yeah, I mean, I'm probably I'm probably not going to use my free token tomorrow. I mean, everyone gets a free, you know, ultimate legend. I already claim mine sadly. Everyone gets a free AKA player. You know, everyone gets their free, you know, wild card Wednesday eventually. So, as long as you play your solos, I mean, you're going to get a free. I mean, that's a lot of coins for free, so I mean, I would not mind doing St. Brown. It's just there's, I mean, his abilities are good. They're not great. I mean, route tech, I mean, I would say short elite, deep elite are my top two abilities right now. Um, I don't know how he's getting pressure right away. He has no X factors. I came into a drag route. My old line right now is just selling for me. I mean, what are his abilities? Relentless. Doesn't even have any X factors in the defensive line. So why is he getting pressure every play, dude? Finally, we have to get the pass off. I mean, God damn. I mean, he's literally getting pressure. I don't have any time. I mean, it's just getting knocked out. I mean, I, I, or not knocked out. It's just, he's just sacked. I don't know why he has Donald Relentless, but nothing else. How do you have nothing else on Donald? He literally has so many free abilities, dude. Like, just use them. I mean, I like um, the tight end there, whatever his name is. I, I mean, I like Luke, Luke Musgrave. I mean, I'm not really saying he's super overpowered. Same with Carmichael here. He's going against Rodney Barber. If it's one-on-one -on -one here, I might test it. Nope. He has give you help there. I don't know how he's getting this pressure. I mean, this is the best patches I've played my entire life, honestly. Without the... I mean, X-Factors, I get it. It's X-Factors. I don't know how he's doing this without... I mean, I don't, like, I don't know why we're getting rid of the ball so quickly. It doesn't even have good X-Factors. I mean, I, I don't understand why his... I mean, we, we have a pretty damn good old line too. My center sucks. Like, I sold Creed Humphrey, but still, dude, come on. I don't know why he's getting pressure right away. It's a four-man rush, so if I do a four-man rush, I better get the same fucking pressure. I mean, honestly, goddamn. You can't really double team anyone. It's a fucking four man rush. Doesn't even have any freaking X factors. Honestly, bro. I mean, it does piss me off a little bit because come on. Don't even have time for a fucking route. Two of them have no effing abilities. My lord. There's Amy Runs. I mean, I never said it was impossible. It's just, my God, why is this game so tough sometimes? I mean, it's the best pass for some, you know, mankind. And we have a top O line in the league. With the secure protectors and...
We got to pass the ball here. I might go to the drag here to need to Jefferson. Nope. I should have ran with Bo. It's my fault. I mean, that one's my fault, but I mean, come on, man. Like, we got to get in the end. Derrick Henry in franchise. Oh my god, dude. He is a nightmare to bring down, dude. Haven't really played enough enough of Derrick Henry in Mutt, but this game is honestly so bad. Bro. It, it, it is honestly like, honestly, I mean, you just can't make this shit. The ball just, it's a magnet right to his, to car. I mean, what the fuck? I mean, that is honestly so bad. Of course, it's a throw out of a sack instead of a 15 yard loss. This game is just, oh my fucking. Tariq Woolen is so fucking good, too. I mean, what the fuck is wrong with this guy? 6'4", goes right. How do you throw it over a 6'4 corner? I mean, I know Carmichael is 6'8". I get that. But I'm like I'm still a 6'4 corner. And you just, like, so casually just throw it you know, over my head. What? Like, you cannot throw it over a 6'4 corner's head. And then even with that, it wasn't even like incomplete. I had no knockout because I was in man coverage, not zone. But all right, there we go. We get wow. I don't. I don't. Finally, we get something to go our way. Pick artist, and he didn't. Wow, we got lucky there because Justin Reed literally has no pick artist. The chem. First of all, we're getting internet issues here. Let's just pause the game. Let's just pause the game, internet reset. Just let the internet we just let the internet reset. Uh, I think he's he lost. Like, I mean, how are we getting a DC loss, man? Fuck this game. Honestly, I'm just, I'm pissed off right now. I was too soul battles and whatever. Try to have fun and whatever. That's what you fucking do. But yeah, Jimmy, um, 
Oh, God, DeAndre. No, I didn't see that, dude. But, yeah, forget it. My my internet's bad right now, guys. I'm sorry. Uh, Jimmy, it's Vanguard. If you have Vanguard ability or Vanguard X Factor, that will help your run block. Yeah, what's up, DeAndre? Yeah, guys, I'm just going to play Soul Battles and just get my daily goal. Just do it the most boring way possible. So, yeah, the, uh, uh, you know what, EA? It's not even EA's fault. It's just my, my internet. I mean, it's literally pure luck, bro. Like, my internet, it's not great, but it's not bad either. Like, I don't know why it just does that. Like, it's been overall a good year. Like, I would say we've had, like, three really bad nights all year. Like, come on, bro. Like, I mean, that that's fucking bullshit. I mean, I'm not going to sit there and play a stream where the internet, I mean, I, like, I have Ethernet. It's not the speed, it's the reliability of it. It's not my internet speed, it's just the fucking thing is just cutting out. It's, it's just fucking bullshit. Like, I mean, like, because I can't do anything about it. That's what pisses me off in this world. I can't, I can't do anything about it. Can't fix it, can't, I mean, maybe reset it, but even then, is it really that worth it? I mean, like, it's probably just some spectrum thing in the air tonight or something. I mean, whatever, bro. So, whatever. I mean, it's a mud champ game. We lost. That guy sucked ass, and we just sucked ass more. Um, I mean, we, we, we got to get our daily goals done. So, I'm going to do it in the most fun way possible. I'm, you know, I, I'm going to do a little soul battle game, a little off stream. Fucking bullshit. I mean, we'll play tomorrow. It'll be more fun. And, you know, there'll be content tomorrow, tomorrow, aka whenever. I mean, tomorrow, aka Monday. I mean, it'll be, like, it'll still be fun tomorrow. It's just tonight. Just, if the internet's not going to do it, what the fuck, dude? Like, I mean, come on. I mean, to be fair, I, I mean, this is the last thing I'll say, bro. I've already said this a million times. But, again... I live at my parents still. So they don't have the best Wi-Fi, bro. So, you know, once I get my own place, I'll get the best Wi-Fi possible. I don't care how much it costs. I'm going to pay for it. Because obviously Wi-Fi and the reliability matters. I mean, to be fair, reliability matters more than speed. No one cares about speed if it's not reliable. So, I mean, you know, whatever, bro. I mean, it just kind of ruins the night. But, I mean, uh, you know, again, guys, on the bright side, on the bright side, I did sell almost all my cards. So, oh, speaking of, we better sell it right now, actually. What's up, Zach? T-Bone. Try a reset? Dude, even if I reset it, I mean, I'll try a reset, whatever. But trust me, bro, I, I it, it's not my router. I, I think it's just... Overall, right now, what's happening in the game? How many Super Bowls? What's, what's up, MB? Um, I'm I'm probably gonna sell Carmichael, bro. I don't give a rat's ass. He's good, but man, he can't do shit for me. If he sells for eight thirty, I'll take it. And also, the reason why is because first of all, I bought him for three fifty. So in a way, he is a rental. But guys, here's the thing, though, dude. They're gonna drop like NFL draft wide receivers, definitely a ring of a ring of honor wide receiver. So there's so many damn receivers in the game, dude. I mean, I know he has 99 speed. Brian Branch, if he goes for 550, I'm selling him. 530, I mean, really say less. I mean, his press sucks, and also he's not really making fucking plays with me. I mean, these cards, bro. I mean, like I said, I mean, I, you know, I mean, some of these cards, bro, I'm telling you right now, they are pretty damn expensive. I mean, I'm not saying Ring of, you know, I'm not saying, you know, Ring of Honor is going to be really that great, but it really, it really should be. Now, Ted Hendricks, if he's almost 700K, I'll sell him right now for 700. I mean, again, say less. Because, I mean, I still want a linebacker with mid-zone KO. 700K is a high right now. I'm telling you guys right now, at any point, that market's going to tank, dude. 
If we can get 701, I'll take it. If not, not meant to be. Good job, Jay. Great profit, bud. Now, Luke Musgrave is a cheap-ass bitch. There's really no reason to sell him. I mean, I don't even care if he's for... I mean, you know, we, I mean, he's a rental. Just keep him. He has what? 97 speed or 98 speed? I mean, he has 98 speed with the Sugar Rush item. He has 99 speed. I mean, th th there's really no reason to get rid of him. Nico Collins, absolutely get rid of him. I mean, we, we pretty much are selling our entire team. Because the reason why is because, dude, not, I, I mean, I mean, first of all, the season's over. In nine days, we get a brand new season. So new season means new cards, new wave, new whatever. Like, I mean, like, the only reason, I mean, dude, like, Things are going to reset. Once things reset, you know, like, I mean, I just feel like, the, dude, I mean, there's, I mean, dude, I'm kind of talking in circles here, but we don't know anything. The only thing I know, okay, and I'm being dead ass honest with you guys, okay, I don't want to lose coins. Because I'm telling you right now, bro, you know, once that NFL draft promo drops, which, I mean, that's not going to be for another two weeks, but still, it might look bad right now. Okay, cool, a few days, whatever. I know Easter, the market just dropped a lot, but the real promo, the reels promo, we got AKA coming tomorrow. I mean, I could probably rebuy my whole team tomorrow and probably still make coins if I want, you know, if I wanted to. So you guys got to understand, bro, you know, it's, it's not always about, and I've been doing this a lot more this year than ever. Cause I, I mean, I, you know, I used to not do this that much, sell your whole team, whatever, but here's what it comes down to, bro. Okay. It's not about selling just for the ring of honor promo. It's not just about, you know, again, X, Y, Z, X, Y, Z, what it's about is even if I like if I sell him for 420 and if I buy him for 360 I still made 20k coins so if I take 20k coins times even 15 players if I sell 15 players right now and if I make 20k on each player I just made 300k coins because these players they're not going to go up much more. I mean, they're already up a little bit from Easter. So, you know, I mean, I get it. You got to have fun. Well, I had fun all year. I mean, you know, I mean, I played Madden all, you know, all year, two hours a day for fucking eight months. So I get it. Everyone wants to play. And again, I get it. It's just what MB said. It's pretty much a business. I mean, we are now at the part of the year where I'm not fucking around because this is it. I mean, I've said it for the last five days. I'm sorry if I'm boring you guys, but I mean, you know, I mean, here we are getting DC. I mean, 330, say less. I mean, that's up 10%. I mean, like, I mean, at the end of the day, bro, I don't know which day it's going to be. NFL draft promo could be it. Okay. But there's going to be a day where they just drop like, you know, 20 98s or whatever. I mean, you know, the Ring of Honor is going to be like 15 cards. Last year was 15 cards. It should be at least 15 for this one. And those cards are going to be so good that you may see a card just tank. Now, even though it's a punter, even though it's a punter, let me show you right now an example. Okay, Jamie Gillian. Even though it's a punter, he literally dropped 300K in one day. He dropped more than that. 1.1 to 400K. Now, I know he's free. I know it's because they dropped a free Pat McAfee. He was free. I get that. But it doesn't matter. What it shows you is we're at the part of the year 
where they drop a lot of 98 99s like, like i mean pretty much all these cards are really good okay and all these cards are very similar like for example like when we drop this card right here john amos right or whatever right i, I mean even bob gollick right bob gollick he may drop i mean we'll see what abilities he has you know that may drop mean joe green i mean you know you know, you may see Mean Joe Green go from 750 to even 600. That's still a 20% drop. So, it, you know, I'm not saying that we're not going to play for four days. I mean, I'm still going to play next or whatever. All I'm trying to say is some of these players, they may just, I mean, even if they drop 20%, you still buy them back. I still made 500K profit. Okay. I mean, you know, look at Aaron Donald. Okay, let's try for 330 here. You know, look at Aaron Donald, right? Well, Jimmy, the Super Bowl, pro I'm shocked. I'm shocked you still have a Super Bowl theme team. I'm shocked. I mean, I doubt he'll sell here for 330. I mean, I doubt it. But I mustn't have put him up. He sells, he sells. If not, who gives a rat's ass? Because if not, I'll keep him. I mean, I like I have no problem keeping him. Obviously, I have a lot of BNDs, okay? Now, in terms of the halfback, I already told you guys I'm having Peyton Manning gameplay tomorrow night. So, Bo Jackson, we'll try to sell him here for 300 overnight. If not, not meant to be. Tomorrow is Peyton Manning gameplay because you guys like my like my post, which is awesome. I mean, I like Bo Jackson, whatever, but 300k is still up, still up a lot from, from like Easter and shit. And like I said, I mean, I have two Aaron Donalds that still have to sell, so two Aaron Donalds at the sell are gonna be a lot of coins for me. Right now, I'm gonna try 1.33 overnight. I doubt he'll sell for 1.33, but, you know, we'll see. Oh, nice, MD, nice. Yeah, um, what we're going to do, the halfback, even though they're dropping a halfback tomorrow, dude, it's so hard to beat Bo Jackson. I mean, it's so hard to beat Bo Jackson. That angry run shit. I mean, I might drop him here, you know, because maybe they'll drop a better running back tomorrow. You know, m maybe they will make it a better X Factor somehow or something. I mean, 300K is still up. Like, I mean, he was 240. He was 240 on Easter. He's up 20%. You know, what's he going to do? Go from 300 to 360? And go back where he was a month ago. I mean, like, dude, there's just no way these. I mean, I'm actually curious how much we have on my team right now. Harrison Bucker, if he's 95k, I'll probably sell that. That you know, son of a bitch. I mean, 90k is probably a sell because we literally got him for 65k today. So I mean, I'll take my 20k, 20k there. Just sell him overnight for 90k. Dude, you can do it set for cheaper, bro. Absolutely. So, I'm telling you guys right now, we probably have almost 11 million coins. Because if I sell Carmichael and Hendricks, Brian Branch already sold for 530. I mean, guys, keep in mind, I had 10 million coins for Easter. I think I had 10.9 mil. If we sell both Donalds for 1.3, that's going to clear 2.4. 2.4 plus Carmichael plus Hendricks. I mean, just do the math, guys. I mean, we probably have over 11 million coins. Which, like I said, that might seem like a lot of coins. Dude, I mean, you're going to want... All the coins, you. this is NMS now. You know, there is no being greedy. Are you, I mean, are you kidding me? I mean, I literally did not get, I mean, I'm a little salty about it. 
okay? And I know it's not till July 1st, plus or minus. You know, we still have three months, okay? We still have, you know, you know maybe two and a half months, okay? We still have two and a half months, whatever, till the games or whatever. But guys, I did not get, I did not get all the rookie premieres last year. And I think I had about 8 million. About 8 million. Now, you can get all the premieres with like 12, 13, 14 million. But I would say you need 12, 13 million minimum. So if they do all 32 premieres again this year, which like MB said, uh, how much did I get Donald for? Dude, I got Donald for like 990. 990. So no matter what, I made profit. Even if I make 100K each, that's still 100K each. So I'm not worried about Donald right now. If he sells for 1.33, great. If not, whatever. Um, we still have a lot of BND cards, dude. A lot. I mean, you can still have fun online, dude. Now, in terms of clearing your binder, I mean, I can try my best, but dude, these cards don't go for anything. Even a 90 Night Train Lane, what? 9,000 coins? I mean, 11,000, whoop de do, but I mean, that's going to you know, really make me rich. So rookie premieres is, I mean, the reason why rookie premieres matter is because if you max them out, you get an 87 overall master for next year. So, I mean, I appreciate, I mean, to be fair, guys, I mean, you know, Zach Evans did ask, which is nice, but I mean, I don't really want to sit there and explain for hours and hours, but pretty much what rookie premieres is, is last year what they did was they were literally giving you, okay, that's what they were last year. So this year, okay, if you maxed all them out, you got a free 87 Aiden Hutchinson. And this was a free card auctionable for next year. And if you go to Aiden Hutchinson, I mean, obviously, obviously you should not sell him right away. But if you were to sell him, which you definitely should have, his, uh, his abilities weren't that great. But, you know, whatever, you literally got a free 400k coin which is a lot of coins for doing pretty much nothing besides just so rookie premieres is a head start for next year and i was not able to get him and it kind of made me a little upset because obviously we you know we are nms we play the game a lot and that's why i feel like hey look like i want to prepare for rookie premieres because at the end of the day that's what matters the most you know, May 1st, May 2nd, you know, next month, whatever. It matters. I mean, obviously this year matters. But what matters more at at these point, at this point in the game, what matters more is you don't want to, like, like, it's also, P, you know, PTSD. Because I had the playoffs promo, okay? I will never forget the playoffs theme team. Okay, I will never ever forget the playoffs theme team. So if I go right now to Tristan Wirfs, I go right now to upgrades, I put playoffs cam on him, right? The playoffs promo and the Super Bowl promo, those chems, look at these chems right now. The playoffs chem was one of the first ever in Mutt history to have over 50 components. If you had 60, you literally had plus three speed. Plus three speed, even plus throw power, plus awareness, plus three, ex plus three acceleration, plus four agility. The playoffs theme team was so awesome. Okay, limited time. They had Dre Greenlaw. They had limited time. Travis Kelsey, tight end. He went for over a million coins. Like, honestly, it feels like yesterday. And that was literally back in January. So fast forward yourself. I mean, that's almost going on three months ago in like a week or two. So honestly, it's hard to believe. But I lost. I mean, I, I, I'm being serious, guys. 
I probably lost over a million coins, if not 1.5 million coins, once the Super Bowl promo came out. Because when you had all the playoffs cards, I'm not really sure when it was. I'm not really sure, you know, whatever. But if you go right now to Travis Kelsey, the playoffs LTD, right? There was a moment when he just dropped. Like, I'm not sure when it was, I'm not sure, you know, whatever, but once they came out, I mean, I think that was when it was, you know, when, uh, when he was reduxed on the 15th or whatever, but I mean, there was a time, maybe it was right there, 1.5 to 1 million, but there was a time when literally everything just dropped like 40%. And to be fair, a lot of it is luck and you can't really control the market that much. But all I'm trying to tell you guys is I lost probably over a million guaranteed. I don't know if it was 2 million coins, but I had, because the, the, the NFL playoffs, I'm telling you right now, like that was the best theme team in the game. Like if like like everyone thought if you had a sixty out of sixty playoffs theme team, you were pay to win. That's how good it was. That's how expensive it was. And once it literally dropped, you know, you lost a lot of coins. You lost a lot of value. And so all I'm trying to say without overthinking it is look, man, I'm not losing that many coins ever again. Because obviously this game, you know, it doesn't mean it's boring, but it is a lot of work. You know, you put a lot of time into it, you know, NMS, whatever. You put a lot of time in the game. I'm not going to sit there and lose all those coins. You know, I'm not going to sit there and go through that shit again. You know, because again, once you are towards the end game, anything can drop at any point. Um. So, you know, and, and also there's just so many good cards. There's so many good cards that, I mean, how can you really say, you know, Carmichael was the best by far. So two cards sold there, Brian Branch, and then also someone sold for over 400K. Who sold for 410K, dude? Brian Branch for 530, I'll take that because, I mean, I bought him for 480. So we, we we pretty much just broke even for Brian Branch. Um, who sold for four hundred, dude? Oh, Nico Collins. Okay. I mean, I don't really care about him, really. I I don't. I don't really care about him. I mean, he's good, but he's not gonna be. Yeah, pretty much T Bone. I mean, yeah, true Venom. Oh, nice Venom, nice. Yeah, I don't know, T-Bone. I'm probably not going to play Souls on stream, bro. I I mean, I really appreciate the support. I really do. But, I mean, there's just no reason to play a Soul on stream, bro. I mean, I appreciate the support of those who would watch play Soul Battles. Dude, I'm just going to pop music in and just get it done. And, and to be fair, I'm not even going to be, like, I'm not even going to lie to you guys. Obviously, it is a little bit of ADHD for me. I just hate Solos, man. Like, I mean, I think we all do. Like, it's fun. It's not like super fun, but it's fun. It's just, dude, we all know that it's not the most exciting stuff. Okay. Um, you know, like I said, guys, I mean, um, if Ring of Honor sucks, then I will definitely take the blame for it. But I just think that Ring of Honor is going to be, you know, it's going to be a pretty good promo. And they're going to drop some good cards. And I really hope it drops the other prices of other cards. So that's kind of all I'm going to say, dude. What's up, Joe? Yeah, well, f you know, first of all, Joe, I'm trying to sell Carmichael. Well, I'm kind of I'm kind of selling my whole team here, Joe. Uh, I'm selling my whole team besides Musgrave. He's pretty much rental. I'm going to keep one Aaron Donald. Why not? Because you got to keep one in your squad. Uh, well, to be fair, I just realized we have three Aaron Donald. So if we actually sell all three coin value wise, we I mean we may have almost 13 million coins. 
Um, so, you know, honestly, maybe I shouldn't really be as much of a cheap ass. I mean, I am being a little cheap right now. Obviously, it's not even really that, you know, secretive. I mean, my my big thing is look. Like I said, I'll say it one more time. It's the last time I'm singing the entire stream. I feel like there's going to be a big market crash coming. It's just what happens in April and May. May is more for golden tickets. But for April, we're getting a brand new season, brand new comp pass in two weeks, NFL draft promo, Ring of Honor promo, also some free AKAs. Once it's free AKA day, People might just sell off shit. Oh, it's a free day. I'm going to sell off my real one now or something. I mean, I mean, people are stupid, you know? I mean, you know, so, I mean, who knows? Um, The free UL day already passed. But, I mean, I just feel like at the end of the day, it's like, dude, you know, you just got to be smart. You know, I mean, you can have fun and play 10 hours all you want. But, I mean, we've been playing all year, bro. You know, so in terms of, you know, oh, just have fun, you know, you know, just whatever, play whatever. Dude, I mean, I guess. But, again, I want all the rookie premieres. And, I, you know, I just want to make as many coins as I can because, you know, I just, you know, we all know NCAA football is coming. And NCAA football is coming in July. So once rookie premieres come out in June, I want to be done. I want to be done the first day. You know, so that's kind of my mentality. That's kind of just what it is. Um, but one thing I'll say about Joe, Joe is true here. Someone sold here. Let's, let's see who sold next here. Um, so let's see who sold. So Bo Jackson sold. I think the running the running back sold or or the quarterback and then uh Harrison Bucker sold. So tomorrow I'm getting Peyton Manning for Peyton Manning gameplay cuz you guys voted for it and it won. Um The dude, Darren McFadden is so important, dude. I'm not dumb with mud at all, dude. I'm uh I'm selling my team to rebuy it probably on Thursday for Ring of Honor. Because I'm just telling you right now, bro, like, e like, even if it drops a little bit. Oh, wow. You know, so, I mean, dude. Yeah. I mean, to be fair, it's kind of, you know, tomato, tomato at this point. I mean, um, also, the one thing I'll say as well is um, something about what Joe Z said. I do want to add some volume for you guys. Where, where I think the volume is actually in the main screen. Where is the volume? Oh, yeah. I'm going to try this one. I'm going to try far. Yeah, I'm going to try far. I'm going to see if I can have a farther. That way I can avoid the KOs the most. So I'm going to I'm going to try that. I saw someone comment that. Oh, press select. Got it. So let me go to the volume real quick. Hopefully you guys can even hear the volume cuz obviously sometimes maybe it's glitch or something. I think you can tell it through I'm sure you'll be able to hear it. If not, then whatever. You can obviously hear my mic, obviously. Let me go. Dude, one thing I'll never forget is I will never forget that Madden was literally locked out. Like, when Madden dropped on, like, August 12th, August 13th, whenever, it, I think it was the 12th or whatever, I will never forget so it's going to be on field volume. So we'll see if that makes it more fun for you guys to watch the on field volume. We'll see if you can hear anything.
the free uh good question jeremiah the free wild card wednesday day we don't know yet but still play oh speaking of i gotta play my aka souls anyway i'm probably not gonna claim my free one but yeah So, yeah, I'm probably going to get going, guys. I'm just going to do Souls tonight. My my Wi-Fi is cutting in and out anyway, which is freaking... I mean, I, I already... Hold on a second. Every time I do the best team overall, it always changes my freaking jersey, bro. I don't understand that. So, tomorrow, we're probably going to stream a lot. It's, a, you know, it's literally a content drop, a market drop day. Hopefully, the market drops from that and, you know, whatever. So there's my jerseys. Perfect. Stroud items should not change. Change my defensive playbook back to the Browns, please. Um, everything else should be fine. Okay. So someone else sold here, I think, unless I'm wrong. Nope, we're good. So yeah, AKA Cruz. I mean, get your souls done because, and Wildcard Wednesday, if you want to space it out, because you will get a free Wildcard Wednesday card. That will save you coins as well. Remember, the free AKA Cruise card, if you can wait till 99s, wait till 99s. Do not make the same mistake I made. I wish I had UL, free Randy Moss, free Mean Joe Green. You would have made over 800k coins profit. So don't be a dumbass. I would save your AKA Cruise token. They're probably going to drop 99s. If not, next week, April 15th, guaranteed April 27th. So, yeah, of course, Venom. So, like I said, guys, I mean, I really appreciate you guys. I mean, obviously, we are only selling our team to rebuy it this week. So, it's not like we're going to, you know, save the coins, hoard the coins. It's just the market's pretty high right now for some reason. Um, I just feel like I'm really banking on the Ring of Honor promo. I'm... I'm really hoping that they drop a really good quarterback and that will definitely tank. I mean, you got to drop something. God damn it. I mean, drop something. I mean, I'm sick of Bo Jackson quarterbacks all up my ass. I mean, you got to drop some kind of quarterback, dude. I mean, my God. I mean, Bradshaw, I mean, to be fair, Bradshaw's not that bad, but I mean, because he has pass lead for 0 AP all game. Yeah, you too, T-Bone. I mean, I would probably sell Randy once he goes up in price. He'll probably go up like Tuesday, Wednesday. Yeah, you too, Flight. So, yeah, I mean, not really the best stream, guys. But again, don't be fooled. It's nothing against the game. I mean, we have been sucking for gameplay, to be fair. But guys, you have to understand too, bro. We literally already maxed out our season pass and pretty much our comp pass. Like, if I go right now to my season pass, we only need two more levels. We're literally max level. Because, I mean, level 50, I don't really care about... Pa I mean, it, like, I mean, I guess I should care and stuff. But, like, dude, we should still be able to get it easily. Because they add 60,000 XP every time for this right here, this week six, whatever. So, if they add four more for week seven... That's going to be 60K. I have 15K right there. That's 75K. Every day for daily goals, you get like what? 7K XP every day? We still have nine days. What's nine times seven? 63K. 63, that's 130. Plus, we also have, um, that's 130, right? So 130, boom. I'm already level 49. And then to get level 50, I mean, we, we still have the real deals one. So, I mean, I'm going to get it with, you know, I, well, yeah, I think I'm going to get it with Eve. As long as I do my daily goals for the next nine days, I max everything out. I should get max level guaranteed. The comp pass, I've already explained this. If you do your daily goals every day and then you play a little mutt champs, you know, a little head to head seasons. Daily goals is way too much. I mean, they're giving you 24 a day. So we should be able to match it out easily. So in terms of like grinding stuff, we've already grinded almost all the rewards with ease. 
So we've already put our work in. Now it's a matter of, I appreciate that, Jared. Now it's a matter, okay, the blue currency, I'll be honest with you, bro, I have no idea. Club points or something, I don't know. But, you know, real deals, I mean, I've already explained this, bro. Like, literally, you can get max level pretty, I'm, well, who cares about max level? Who the hell cares about max level? Because a 95 BND, all that is is training. Training is so cheap right now. Carl Weathers, I mean, he can go, you know. I mean, he, you know, I can give a rat's ass. Because Micah Parsons, you see what I'm saying? So, I mean, I'm just speaking facts. You know, I mean, right now, you're not really grinding for anything. Now, some of you might grind. Maybe some of you guys are behind. But if you're not behind, if you're up to date and you've been playing, you know, an hour a day and you, you know, you know, guys, you know, we've already done the passes. So it's not like we're playing for all these rewards right now. We're kind of just playing just for online pickup streets, you know, a little street football. Well, bro, at that point, just get your coins back and just just take your coins right now because coins is king. So, it you know, it's kind of the boring answer, but like at the end of the day, bro, you know, if you want to be no money spent, bro, it, that's kind of how you live life. You know, it, it, it's kind of what it is. You know, it, it's, I mean, that's kind of life, bro. So, I mean, I'm playing solos right now off stream. We'll go from there, boys. Free Xavian, exactly. Exactly, gaming. Yep, smart man there, gaming. Smart man. All right, guys. Tomorrow's going to be a big day. Solar Eclipse, and we're going to play a lot of fun.